Hi, I'm Glenn Boomer from Opico, product specialist for Heaver, and we're here today at Project Lamport, working alongside AgriVista, looking at metal and roots within the establishment of crops. It's clearly a lot more open, aggregated, um, more stable as a structure. There are still little angular lumps in, but they've got plenty of roots through them. As I break it down, huge amount of fibres, even got a few wormholes in there as well. Now worms are still pretty well dormant because of the amount of, of dry weather we've had, but hopefully you can see from this that we've got a, a very much more structured, open, porous structure. Uh, capable of allowing those roots to go through. So the other thing you can probably notice then is we've got fewer, slightly fewer roots concentrated in the surface simply because they can, as this crop is pushing roots out, they're finding their way through to depth as opposed to concentrating on that surface zone. So the, the action of the, of, of the stealth loosening has clearly allied to the cover crop roots as, as, as given the, the roots of this crop pathways to get down and basically follow those cover crop roots down through the profile. Having sort of excavated the profile um, again as a contrast to uh, the fallow situation as I, as I put the knife in um, it, it, it's, it's as near as chalk and cheese as you're ever going to get really isn't it in that respect easily crumbling falling falling down falling apart plenty of roots all the way through to depth. It's easy to move the soil uh, right the way down into the subsoil zone. Um, so provided we can just give the roots enough chance, cover crop roots, give them enough chance to establish and then get through deeper in the profile, we can actually save working depth of metal. And as you'll all be aware, working depth of metal, the deeper we work, the more fuel we consume, the more power we need, the more draft it takes to pull the metal of any description. Therefore, if we can save depth, we're going to save cost of fuel uh, to a certain extent, quite a significant extent at times. And, and this is really where we've started to think that the, the combination of roots and metal, basically, the metal is enhancing what nature we're asking nature to do by the root growing action, the shrinking and swelling uh, action of the of, of, of the moisture removing cycling by the, the covers. So all in all what we're trying to do really here is is say that we've got a almost a synergistic relationship between metal and roots. We're now just looking at the stealth low disturbance point, 120 millimeters wide tungsten tip on the front using this at 200 millimeters or even 150 millimeters a leg spacing of about um, 50 centimeters we're moving all the soil in that top surface creating the required soil movement and fissuring to establish the next crop and we can see the surface is even the crop is even even so the stealth is that point and leg to take you forward.